guys, it's Mr. Mike, and this is the first project we're going to do for my summer camp here at South Arkansas Art Center and Summer Camp 2020. So the first thing you're going to need is that that little 6x6 six six foam core board. It could be cardboard, it could be anything you want. It doesn't really matter as long as it's about 6 inches by 6 inches square. You also need those colored uh, straws all different colors uh, some of you may already have some straws and they may be different colors just try to get a bundle of those you'll also need some elmer's glue all right maybe a nice pair of scissors all right for this particular project what we're going to be working on is an abstract piece of 3d art okay to hang on the wall and i'm going to show you what it's going to look like right here 3d artwork all right so also in your package you may have already a longer straw don't use that one put that back in the bag if you happen to have the bag also if you have a bundle of straw uh, straws and you have that rubber band we need that rubber band for something else so put that back in the bag so you got your straws you got your board you got your glue and you got your scissors let's get going on the first 3d abstract art project for this camp. Okay, so you've got your straws, rubber band in it, but we're gonna take that off in a minute. Then of course our foam core board, our black foam core. Let's put that over there for a second. Now I'm gonna get the board and I've taken off the rubber band and there's your straws. Yep, see, I'm gonna take that rubber band and put it back in my bag. You also need a pair of scissors. But let's get going here. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna decide on some sizes of our straws. So we might want to cut a couple of these off depending on the design that we're going to come up with. So as you can see, I'm going to kind of choose that length there and I'm going to place that right about there when I get it set up. And so I'm going to get some of that Elmer's glue here. You could also try using a glue stick, but I think the Elmer's glue is probably going to work a little bit better. So I'm going to try the glue stick first and see how well it sticks. I'm going to put some glue right on the right on the straw and I'm going to stick it down there and it's probably not going to be quite as sticky as I want it so I think I'm going to move to the Elmer's glue. So I'm going to get my Elmer's glue and I'm going to make sure I can get it out here and I'm going to put a little bit of glue right on the straw all the way up. Then I'm going to place it right down where I want it, right on the board, in a shape, in an in a angle. It could be anything. It could be uh, straight up and down. Then I'm going to get the other piece that I cut off, and I'm going to maybe cut that off a little bit. I, I like the straight edge a little bit more than the hooked edge. And I'm going to decide where I want to put that one. And I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to put glue on that edge, and I'm going to just place that where I want it to go. Once I get that down, I am just going to create and have fun. I am going to glue and cut and place all of these straws in different colors in different ways so they can just look great on the, uh, on the piece. So I'm going to let you decide on how you want to do, but just continue figuring out which way you want to put it and then put the glue on. I'm kind of taking different colors. I'm mixing and matching them a little bit. I'm playing around with the size or area or the space on the blackboard. I'm taking the glue, I'm pushing it, I'm holding it down for a few seconds on each one. That'll help glue them in place. And you have fun with this. You can even get some other colors if you wanted to. You could get some other straws. You might have some other straws in the house that you might want to use. I gave you some that I thought were going to be pretty cool. I put some dots of glue right there on those straws and I'm going to kind of angle that one a little bit, glue those straws together so it's kind of on top. So it's going to be a 3D abstract piece of art using these straws on top of this board on top of other straws. I can't wait to see what you do 
and how you set yours up and the design that you come up with. It's going to be cool. So I'm kind of getting to the end there. You may not use all your straws. You don't have to use all your straws. You could use some to drink some juice later. But I'm going to take the glue and I'm going to finish up here and then let it dry at least a half an hour before we do the next step, which is hanging our artwork. I've got my piece of art. I'm going to hang it up with the rest of the art. I can actually choose any which way I want to go. You can hang it in any direction. I think I'm going to do it on an angle. Just like that. Voila!